Welcome to a new series of videos designed to show off the hard work that we've been doing on the upcoming Appraise It Pro. We plan on releasing new videos often to keep you updated on the progress as it nears completion and release to you, our users. So let's get started and take a look at some of the improvements to the look and feel of Appraise It, the user interface. Fresh but familiar. That could be the best way to describe the new Appraise It Pro. Years in the making, this new version of Appraise It is completely new from the ground up. But don't let that scare you. We've taken great strides to ensure this new version of SFREP software with roots dating back to 1983 will be easy to learn and comfortably familiar. The new Appraiser Pro user experience is built around the ribbon, a concept introduced by Microsoft a few years ago in Office that is now a key part of the Windows 10 look and feel. It's modern, user-friendly, and visually organizes the myriad of options available in Appraiser Pro, so common tasks can be easily found and accessed with contextual tabs that automatically present options for the currently selected field. We've kept the menu options similar to Appraise It 2 so our current users can minimize the time it takes to find specific selections. Fresh, but familiar. A quick launch toolbar has also been added, and it's customizable. Choose how it'll work for you and your own workflow. The concept of WYSIWYG, or what you see is what you get, is probably a familiar one to most people, even if you don't quite know what it means. What you type in Appraise It's fields is exactly what it will look like when printed to paper or PDF. Though this feature was introduced in the previous Appraise It, it's much more refined than Appraise It Pro. Typing into text fields in Appraise It Pro is quick, easy, and very familiar. Keyboard movements and many of the shortcuts from the previous versions of Appraise It have been carried over, but some new enhancements have been added as well. One key addition that has us excited is automatic text resizing. As you type in a field, if you begin to run out of space, the text will begin getting a little smaller. This is great when you just need to fit a few extra characters into the field, but don't want to have to mess with the font size. Other features that we've added include easily accessible customization options in the ribbon toolbar above, different colors for non-editable UAD and extended comment fields, highly customizable color schemes, and new format and UAD helper panels that can be moved around for a customized and efficient look and feel. Checkboxes have a cool new feature too. While the older Praise It had keyboard shortcuts for these boxes, many users were not aware of them. Now these shortcuts are front and center. Just press the corresponding key for the desired checkbox to fill it in without having to use the mouse. Adding an image to your report, just go to the location in the report, double click, and browse the image in. The new Acquire feature also supports browsing to most cameras and mobile phones that are connected to your computer in addition to scanning. Have an old report that you need a photo from? Just save the file and extract the photo to your computer. Yes, the new appraise is going to be new and different, but familiar too. We'll be conducting live trainings to help you with the transition, and we think you'll catch on pretty quick. Lots of new features are coming, but your comfort will be at the top of our priority list. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter for the latest news and updates on Appraise It Pro, and look for live demos soon. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.